see me I had to turn on the light <laughs> um, I just finished a quad and glute workout it's Valentine's Day so happy belated Valentine's Day hope you've had a wonderful time with your significant other or yourself or your friends or your animals whatever um, I just got my butt kicked I didn't even record that full workout um, we really only did like three supersets but they were difficult and long and I was explaining this to Jake. I'm like, I don't think I'm getting sick, but I think I've been fighting something off for so long. And like, even though I feel better during the day, when I go to work out, I am just fatigued so quickly, like so quickly. And that's what happened today. Like during our warm up, I had to do walking lunges and I was dead. <laughs> and then, I mean, I'm just like so, so disgusting. I was also up late last night working on the balance video, so that didn't help, but anyway, have my smoothie. It's going to be a good day. I'm at least happy that I got that workout in, but I burned like 600 calories in less than 60 minutes because my heart was like so high. <laughs> my heart rate was so high the whole time. It was ridiculous, so let's head home. I need to finish the video. Now, now you can't see me at all. All right, see you later. much later in the day I was exhausted I went and trained my clients got the balance try on posted came home got some work done and then took a nap it was only like 30 40 minutes um, and then tried to clean our place and it's Valentine's Day like I mentioned Friday he got off work early so then we chilled when he got home and now we're gonna go to J Alexander's our favorite place maybe get some carrot cake yeah are you oh, gonna yeah. get your key lime pie or whatever? I don't know. It's good. I don't I'm, know. I'm feeling some ice cream tonight, maybe. Oh, <gasps> wait, the ice cream sundae or the dessert? Like the that huge pie. Look at how cute he looks. Are you ready? Ready. Just look how dapper I am. Dapper. <laughs> what a model. Yes. <laughs> that little giggle. Saw the city passing by my window Was in the crowd but I felt so alone Looked at my phone like every other second My future was blurry and numb A tunnel where there's no light Oh but then you came and sat right next to me
Saturday night. Chris and I just got home from the gym doing cardio and I just wanted to show you guys. I posted this on Instagram, but got a good sweat session. I was just really tired the past couple days because of how busy of a week I had, but I made up for the cardio I didn't do and I'm committed to until the Arnold. I'm going to like five days a week I'm going to do cardio at least 30 minutes probably just 30 minutes I can't see myself doing any more than that but um, cardio is something that motivates me so much to eat healthier like it sucks when you're doing it but once you're done it's like because that was so hard I don't know once I'm done I feel super super motivated to eat healthier um, I love lifting so most days like I, I really do enjoy that I don't always enjoy cardio so it's just like something I don't want to screw up. Would you agree with that or is that just me? I don't even hear what you said. It's like, it's like cardio for me is like one of the most motivating things to help me eat better. Sure. Because once I'm done, I'm like, I don't want to yeah. undo all of it. You know what this means, right? What? We're back to the year of the ad. Yeah. Oh yeah? <laughs> Are you going to shoot for two this year? I'm going to shoot for two. <laughs> just two though. Just two. Probably the top You're two. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take a shower because clearly that's disgusting. I feel so nasty. grocery store on the way home from breakfast with my dad and we got most of our usual stuff but we both I told you guys yesterday after doing cardio that I'm like until the Arnold I really need to get my shiz together not that I've been eating poorly I just we've been eating out a lot so we're gonna meal prep our white chicken chili today that's why we have all the ingredients for that um, and then I'm also gonna make the spaghetti squash with the meat sauce. I think that will be really good for lunch. Um, and then I got my salad. I love this stuff. I don't use the dressing in here, but I do use like all the other additives. More peppers and egg whites to make my omelet in the morning. Our bagels, I have Chris hooked on these now too. Mushrooms for my omelet. All of this stuff is for the two meals we're meal prepping. I got more granola to go in our yogurt for parfaits oatmeal some more frozen vegetables i haven't tried these ones before i feel like they'd be good does it look yummy to you she's like you didn't get anything for me where's my stuff um and yeah and then more syrup to go on my pancakes but oh and onions for the recipe so anyway this is a little grocery haul we're gonna meal prep today so i will show you guys i had a lot of people asking if i could show like how we make the white chicken chili. Um, I think there's some confusion with how we make the chicken before. So try to show you guys all of that today. Sorry. I thought you were having a fudge bar right now. <laughs> it's like, really? All right, this is a little different than the instructions that my mom did so you cook this a little bit before you put the actual yeah i just i just brown it on both sides just for a couple minutes before i so i'll butterfly the chicken and just cook a little bit on both sides just to get it going and then add the chicken broth and then i add the broth which you can do like i think my mom when she makes this this is her recipe originally um or at least that's how we started making it she would do like half broth, half water. Um, but then I think she started only cooking it in broth and that's all we do. We don't do water, we just do broth to give it more yeah. flavor. Yeah. So yeah, cook the chicken first, round up a little on each side, then add the chicken broth and I'll show you the next step once we get there. up onion and then four to five cloves of garlic you can see it right there 
Oh boy, all right. Chicken is cooked and you can kind of chop it up or try to shred it a little bit. I know when my brother makes this, they actually make theirs in the like crock pot first or something and they shred it. He said he likes it that way, but we just always. It's probably dangerous and not great for the knife. <laughs> Just chop it up as best you can. Yeah, chop it up, put it back in. So he's gonna do that to all of them. This is the worst part. <laughs> mm -hmm. I said, where's the camera? Hold on. What are you doing? Draining the white corn. Gotta be specific. Raining the white. All right, there you go. Lighting in here is just great. Our can opener is no good. I'm gonna take off my finger. It comes out one way or the other. It's fine. All right, and then two things of green chilies. And these need rinsed. Two cans of rinsed white chili beans bushes. Bushes. Hello. Smell, smell onions. All right, excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me. Look at that back. <laughs> so that's two cans of corn, two cans of beans, two cans of chili. And then one can. One can cream of chicken. The stuff really grosses me out. Look at that slop. It's great. The yucky. Yeah, it's gross. All right. So after this, I like to slop it all together. Listen to that. Just listen. No, ew. ASMR, ASMR. Ew, no. Yeah. Listen. Two and a half tablespoons. Do you guys see how perfect this is? Chili fits? powder. Be generous with the two and a half. Yes. You don't want to sprinkle it around at all? Come on. Sorry. There it is. One teaspoon of cumin. You can go multiple if you like cumin. I don't really like cumin all that much, so I just do one. All right. Lastly. Two tablespoons. So use the tablespoon yeah. thing. Generous with this as well. I love lime juice. Yeah, this really does add. A lot of flavor. Oh, almost there. Can you hold it? <laughs> Teamwork makes a dream work. Woo! Alright, mix it all up and then let it sit. How long do we usually let it go for? Also, salt and pepper to taste if you'd like. Um, and then throw it on low. And I'd say let's sit for at least an hour. Yeah, let all the flavors come together. At least an hour. Two is probably better. And that's it. Nice and easy. That is going to be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. To be completely honest, I don't really remember what the last thing I recorded was. I think I, oh, Chris and I were making the white chicken chili. It turned out great. And I am recording a full week of eating. It's Monday, so I'm one full day into that video. Um, so you guys can look forward to that. It's gonna basically help me document and just like trying to get back on track with the Arnold being two weeks away basically and just trying to get back on track to eating uh, in because we've been eating out way too much but we also just got done watching The Bachelor and if you're watching I would love to know your guys' thoughts 
If Madison doesn't win, I'm going to be real sad. Just saying. But I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any other questions about the Balance Athletica launch, that's not until the 24th. Um, but I know I've been answering a lot of questions recently. So if you still have some questions after my try-on, message me. Uh, comment down below. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.